Bob Mortimer, now 62, suffered tiredness and small pain before being told he needed surgery on his heart. And his journey to better health was a fast one, he revealed on Good Morning Britain, I went to the doctor on the Thursday and the following Monday I got married and then went in for open heart surgery. The comedian, known for his work with Vic Reeves, described the surgery as a big moment in his life, and he's centered his recently published autobiography around it. He continued, It made me look back to the past and also think about what my future might be. So how is he doing now? He added, It's been good, I've got new pipes. I talk about it a lot, my heart problems but when I came out of hospital I felt very unsure what the future was for someone who's had this surgery. How to live longer, the best exercise to reverse aging, major study finding so I'm perfectly happy to talk about it for anyone who's going through it it's okay, you can go fishing, you can write a book. Triple bypass surgery is a type of coronary artery bypass grafting, an open heart procedure that is done to treat three blocked or partially blocked coronary arteries in the heart. The heart needs a constant supply of blood, and is supplied by two large blood vessels called the left and right coronary arteries. Danny Miller Health, the Emmerdale Star's horrible and invisible illness, symptoms, Inside Dementia Diet, 3 Foods to Remove from Your Diet to Help Halt Dementia Risks, Exclusive Bowel Cancer, New Research Demonstrates a Clear Link Between Antibiotics and Tumors, Study, Over Time, These Arteries Can Become Narrowed and Hardened by the Buildup of Fatty Deposits Called Blacks. The NHS Explains, This Process Is Known as Atherosclerosis. People with atherosclerosis of the coronary arteries are said to have coronary heart disease. Your chances of developing coronary heart disease increase with age. You're also much more likely to be affected if you smoke you're overweight or obese you have a high fat diet coronary heart disease is a major cause of death in the UK and worldwide. Symptoms to look out for include chest pain, angina shortness of breath pain throughout the body feeling faint feeling sick, nausea, you can reduce your risk of getting coronary heart disease by making some simple lifestyle changes. These include eating a healthy, balanced diet being physically active giving up smoking controlling blood cholesterol and sugar levels keeping your heart healthy can also have other health benefits, such as helping reduce your risk of stroke and dementia.